we're just walking around, you know, out of the blue, it's just one car just come towards me. Then, you know, I skipped it, barely skipped her. Then, uh, you know, my wife was just uh, two feet feet uh, behind me, just right head to head to struck her. Well, new at six, we're hearing from the husband of one of the victims struck by a hit-and-run driver yesterday in Miami Beach. You remember, we first brought you this story as breaking news on our 5 o'clock broadcast yesterday. Investigators tell us they're still trying to track down the driver responsible. CBS 4's Peter Dench joins us live from Miami, where both victims are still recovering tonight. Peter? Well, Lauren and Elliot, Gene Chang tells you that he and his wife had just arrived here from Chicago and they had planned to go on a cruise tomorrow. That is not going to happen. Now he says he's just grateful that she survived this ordeal. Gene Chang tells me that he and his 61-year-old wife, Lena, had just arrived in Miami and were walking together at 44th Street and Collins Avenue on Thursday afternoon when suddenly she was struck by a car. We just walk around, you know, first time in Miami, just landed, less than five hours. We just, you know, we just walk around. We just walk around, uh, you know, just first time. So, you know, we were exciting, just walk on the sidewalks. Out of the blue, it's just one car just come towards me. Then, you know, I skipped it, barely skipped her. Then, uh, you know, my wife was just uh, two feet feet uh, behind me, just right head to head to struck her. She, you know, she just airborne it. He says his wife was fortunate. Luckily, she, you know, her head was hit, you know, hit on the side of a bush. So uh, wasn't you know wasn't that big big of damage, but uh, her shoulder and knee and uh, I think the doctor told me she have a little problem with her lung too. Lena Chang was left with bruises to her head, shoulder and knee, and a broken collarbone. She's feeling fine. You know she coughed a little bit. I think uh, they're gonna monitoring you know monitoring for her for a couple more days. Moments after that accident, Miami Beach police say the same driver also struck and nearly killed a man further north on Collins Avenue at. 57th Street. How do you feel about what happened here? This person just took off. I don't. What can I say? You know, they have a lot of crazy people out there. I mean, uh, it just ha you know, it, it just happened to us. We just uh, living in such a crazy world right now. Why people does that? I really doesn't know. I understand that he struck the other person. That the other person is in very critical condition right now. He's in the same hospital. Now, Chang tells me that his wife's condition is stabilized. The second person who was hit is in critical condition. Miami Beach police say they're looking for a black four-door sedan with tinted windows that took off northbound on Collins Avenue. If you can help, call them or Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. We are live at Jackson Memorial Hospital. Peter Danch, CBS 4 News.